Hey guys, and welcome back to Macho Gaming. I'm your host, the Macho Hype Man, otherwise known as Macho Gaming. And today, we are back again with some more The Walking Dead Telltale Season 2. In the last episode, we went fishing, we saw men get attacked, and Pete got bit. And now, we are here on Chapter 2, well, Episode 2, I should say. A house divided. Thank you all so much for the like and support that you've shown this series. And with that being said, let's do this. With how the last episode ended with that major cliffhanger, I am thrilled. To see who we're gonna. On the Walking Dead. Oh, hold on. I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington, then talk to me about coal. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! I'm out! Grab her! Let's go! Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Yeah, who is Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! Yeah. I'm fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way! Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you! Uh, I felt terrible making this choice. We have to go. You could have saved him. How could you just leave him? It's not like I wanted to. The man was bit. What was I supposed to do? He was going to turn anyways. Uh, I probably should have went with Pete. I certainly like Pete a lot more than I like you, Nick. Hmm? The Walking Dead. Oh, great. That's a lot of dead folk. X, 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 X. Oh. that holds but a little warning would have been nice I'm sorry about Pete whatever I am dude I'd you leave my uncle back at the stream why'd you follow me he got bit. What? He got bit. He wasn't going to make it. I'm sorry to tell you that, dude, but that's the truth. What do we do now? I don't care. If we're stuck here, we should at least look around. Maybe we can find something to help us get out of here. Knock yourself out. Man, I get, 
I get that you're depressed, and I didn't want to leave Pete, but he was bit. Still. I know what it is. The fuck you do. Okay, what then? It's for making booze. Get that rig ain't fit to piss in. Oh, great. Booze. Alcohol. Uh... I can really only click on these two things? I guess we'll search the crate first. All this food is rotten. I said this food is rotten. Yeah, he's not gonna talk to us, Clem. What is that stuff? Let me see. <sighs> Ew. Whiskey. Now what? Oh, fuck if I know. We wait, I guess. Now's not the... Okay, I'll admit, you actually need the drink, so... I'll let it slide this time. <sighs> Man, I feel terrible for Nick. The dude loses his mother, and then loses his uncle. Oh, man. Whoa. Dude? You're gonna draw more dead folk. I get that you're pissed, but... Now's not the time to be creating noise. I got him to stop. I had to kill my mom. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Oh, wow. Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on his big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. Everyone I grew up with. It all happened to them. What? They turned? Get bit? Now. It's gonna happen to us. We're all so fucked. This whole world is fucked. No, we'll, we'll make it. Bullshit. I mean, what's the point? We'll just march to some new place and somebody else will die. It's never gonna stop. Eventually, it'll be our turn. I can't believe we've been here a day. A day. It's been a day, right? Yeah. Hey, kid. Have a drink with me. Uh, it's gonna be your first and your last. <laughs> why not? I probably shouldn't do this, but... Peter Joseph Randall. The nicest, mean old bastard I ever knew. But it'll make him feel better. I <laughs> oh, see that man smile. <laughs> Listen, they're not coming for us. You should go. Run for it. What are, what are you gonna do? Stay here. I'm tired. Go find Luke and the rest. They'll take care of you. We're good people. Better than me. No. We can make it. We have to try. I don't have to do anything. I'm not giving up on you, Hanek. You might be a dirtbag, but I'm not going to give up on you. Are you kidding? And leave all this? You can't just sit here and die. 
Why not? What does it matter? You still have Luke and everyone else. Their family. Nick, I need your help. Please. Come on, Nick. You're right. Of course I'm right. Yeah. Now look, if we get separated, the cabin's only half a mile from here. You can't miss it. You ready? Hell yeah. Fuck it. <clears throat> Whatever happened to his rifle? Oh. Uh oh. Oh shit. Get the fuck out of here. No, I can't leave him behind. I said get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Whoa, that was so close. Almost died. Wow. Almost died again. Whew. Nick, you better not die on me too. I hope you don't just give up. You better survive. I'm gonna go get help. Clem, you better run like hell. Run, Forrest! Run! Episode 2, A House Divided. Did she run all night? Dang. She must be, I'd be exhausted too. Clementine, are you alright? Luke's not with you? Where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Pete got bit. What? What happened? Walkers. The dead. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. My boys? Damn it, Luke. My OGs? Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. Yeah. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. You're welcome. Although Sarah should really be let in on all this. She definitely needs to. Say cheese. Not that. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. So cool. Selfie. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Please. Sure. sure. Why not? Get me in a good pose, okay? Alrighty. Okay, I'm ready. There we go. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? You should know what's going on. He told you not to tell me, didn't he? Sure he did. He's in trouble. Oh my gosh. What happened? Clem? Pete's dead. Pete got bit by a walker, sweetie. It's alright. Let it out. I get Sorry. it. I, I, I just need to... It's all right. I get it. It's not easy to lose someone you care about. We're partners. I got your back. You want to see what I found? 
Oh boy, what did you find? Whoa! Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? As yeah. long as you don't tell your dad. I won't, I promise. First, remember, it's just a thing. What does that mean? Um, I don't know. Also, I, I wouldn't hold the heavy. gun that close. Okay. What do I do? The most important thing is, when you go to shoot, take a breath before you pull the trigger. <sighs> Not that big. <sighs> what should I shoot? Don't do that! S -s -s sorry Sorry! Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. Hey, Luke's back! Well, she did say that she couldn't find any bullets, so maybe it was empty? Still dangerous, though. Alrighty. Time to head downstairs. That didn't look like Luke. Look outside. Yeah, that didn't look like Luke. Yep, that's not Luke. That is so that's not, not Luke. Luke. Clem, I think I know him. Uh oh. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Where? Anywhere, oh. just out of sight. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. Shh. I'll deal with him. Just go hide and get out of sight. Hello? No, wait, where's the. No, lock it, lock it. Uh oh. Hello there. Uh, hello there. Hello. How are you? Okay, how are you? Well, I'm doing just fine, thank you. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? Sure, they man. You What's knocked on my door. <laughs> my name is George, honey. Uh, nice to meet you, George. Pleasure to meet you. You mind if I come in for a bit? I've been out all morning and this. Uh, here. yeah, I do mind. Yes, I do mind. This is my place. This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Just me and and Dad. Yeah? What's his name? Ed. Strong name. I like him already. Where is he? He's out. Well, said he's out hunting. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish uh -oh. guy and his daughter. Quiet uh -oh. girl. A bit taller than you. Uh-oh. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. Oh, that's a dicky boy. Them. They're dead. You saw who? Where? Down by the river the other day. Walker's got him. I'm sorry. <laughs> the river? You sure about that? Pretty sure. Well, no offense, but I guess that wasn't them. Because the ones I'm looking for are very careful people. If you say so. You're letting off more than... Were you involved with those people? Who got shot by the river? George? It's a lot of plates for two people. Looks like a tornado ran through here. Yeah, well, I'm supposed to be doing the dishes. Uh-oh. Just passing through or you've been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Where do you live? Yeah, down by the river there. There's a sweet little spot with a boat where we pitched camp. Got a few tents up and everything else, and... 
Like I said, I'm surprised we haven't run into each other. How long have you been there? Been there for a good while now. Really? Uh oh. Uh, Clem. Oh, great. Dead giveaway. Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer. Uh, in the drawer there. This dude is really. Oh no, Sarah. Well, this is a real nice place. Kind of cozy. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. So did I. Real smug son of a bitch. But a smart man. What's his name? Carlos. Oh. That's a dead giveaway. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. Uh-oh. What was that? I don't know. I don't know. But you said nobody's here. Uh, probably it's just the wind. Probably just the wind. It's getting colder. Oh, great. This dude pulled out a mini revolver. Nobody's here, sicko. Oh, good, she's hiding. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. Isn't that what you're doing? Uh oh. <gasps> the picture. Oh no. Who's this? Uh oh. Uh. No one. Must be someone who lived here. Must be. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this: When you met them, how much did they trust you? What's your point? People don't trust you. How can you trust them? I don't like you, but that's good advice. Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. But wait, who are you? You have a real good day now. Oh boy. Well, good riddance. Should be glad he didn't check under the bed. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? Then we better get ready to fight, Sarah. If that boy comes back. Oh. We need to find the others. We can't go outside. We're gonna have to, Sarah. Clementine. Oh, never mind. Sarah. You were with Nick, right? We gotta go find him. Nan was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. He said his name was George. George? That's what he said. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? He had a big brown coat. Did it have a lining? A collar? Yeah, fur. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. All right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy or not nice, right? 
You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. Now, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? Yeah, he saw definitely. A picture, of him. a picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. Oh, I took, I took the, picture. the picture. It's my fault. No, I asked her to. It's my fault. Sarah. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Just who is this guy? Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving out. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. Why did you leave his camp? Because we had to. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. I believe you. have to leave. I believe you. Look, we gotta find Nick on our way out of here. You know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. On the road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. So basically, we found this season's Negan. Now you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. I still don't like what you did. Sneaking around on us and taking advantage of my husband. But I know you were in a tough spot. Why is Carver after you? After me? Oh, you mean us? Uh, it's no, I mean story. you in specific, lady. He, he has a hard time letting go. I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. Uh, I'm not used to that. Not is that baby his? I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Ain't that the Alvin truth? and I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Any ideas? Clem? Hold up. Yep, this is where Nick there. was. That's where we were. Oh, great. Oh man, I wanted to open. I wanted to open up a little can of whoop ass. Hit the door. Oh Nick, you better not be dead. Uh, I don't like that luck, Clem. Oh, I really hope he's just passed out. Jesus. Oh, okay, he is. Hey, man. You got any aspirin? Nick, you asshole. Whew. Okay. <sighs> so the guy was just hung over. Oh, man, I do. We gotta get moving. Okay, Carver's gang showed up. Can you make it? Yeah. Yeah. Good, let's go. I'm just glad we got him. Hey, Clem. Uh, I just wanted to say thanks for not giving up on me. I'm sorry about Pete. Yeah. Thanks. Poor Nick. I got you, man. What happened back there in that cellar? Did he do something stupid? Like, you can tell me. I'm uh, just looking yeah. out for him. Yeah, he got drunk. He got drunk. I was scared. God damn it, Nick. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You 
Sure, you still want to come with us? Look, I know we got off to a rough start. Well, I still got to look for Krista. Promises it won't get rougher. I have to look for Krista. She was headed north, right? Yeah. So are we. Look, you're gonna have a better chance of finding her with us than on your own. That's I figure we point. got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. Those are the only choice we got left. I mean, that was a hell of a way to start the episode. Nick got drunk. <laughs> Five day days later. Are we by a river? The poor Rebecca. And I think that map said Virginia, so we're in Virginia now? See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. We've got to find some shelter. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. Okay, well, Here, let's see. eat this back. But we're almost out of food. We gotta save it. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. Oh, uh, well, what else is? What's that? There's a lift or something. Chairlift? Must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. Uh, oh, what's that? There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. Maybe it's a log cabin? Bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? If we get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I no. never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. Yeah. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys you? in 10 minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Thanks, Nick. Hey, Carlos, did you not see what I did in the last episode? Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. They're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Safety? Close. Listen, what's the one thing a guy would walk hundreds of miles to get back? Family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I know what that's like. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure you do, Clem. You've seen a lot of... Uh-oh. Got a couple of dead mother effers. Ugh. Hmm. Can't shoot them. Too much noise. Let's take them. I like your style. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. We should be okay. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. 
I just agree with this plan. Hey, I still got my hammer. Alright, come here, ugly. Go ahead. Give it a good pull. It should come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. Oh, that's a jab. Okay, what am I supposed to do? Oh, there we go. Whew. Nice work, kid. Ow. <laughs> and we're a couple of bloody survivors now. And now we're across the bridge. Or making our way across the bridge, I should say. Uh oh. More dead folk. Oh, it's just a few of them, so we can take them. Me and my big mouth. Uh oh. Look! Oh crap. I'm okay. I just I'm stuck. Whew. I can't reach. It's okay. Clem, look, we'll, we'll figure something out. Behind you. Oh, whoa. Oh, shit. Yeah. Was my thoughts exactly, kid. Oh. Yeah, take out the knee. Bam. Bam. Oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Whoa, that was close. Oh, no. Oh, no. Whew. And there goes my hammer. And that zombie got a late night swim. Whoa! Duck, duck! Hang on, Clam! X, 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 Phew! Whoa! Oh, we get lost, bitch. Alright. Come on. Get in there. Get in there. <laughs> I knew all those years of watching anime would pay off one day. too close for comfort. Glad we got them out of there. That was a scary situation. Thanks, Clem. No problem, Luke. I got your back. Let's keep going. Best to get going. Best to get a move on. What's that? You see him? Oh, great. Yeah. Just our luck. Just play it cool. And you do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. You really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. And don't piss him off. I'd shoot me. Well, that's a hell of a thing to say. I'm just saying. Well, if it comes to that, I'll shoot him first. Well, it's a zombie apocalypse. It's hard to trust anybody. Well, who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. Uh, well, help me out here. Right. I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. Stare down. It's like the Wild West. Oh, no, here he comes. Huh. 
You don't look like assholes. Are you assholes? No offense or anything. But you know how it is out here. Yeah, you're the one holding you're the gun. The one holding a gun. Touche. <laughs> Folks headed north like everyone else. Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. Do you know Carver? Carver? Like George Washington Carver? The peanut guy? What? He's a man. Never heard of him. But no, I want some peanut butter though. Me I gotta too. say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Thanks, no man. Problem. Appreciate it's it. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want. What? The fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? Nick. No, 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 no. He's he's with us. Nick! No! Put it down! Don't shoot! I said don't shoot. Oh no, he He's dead. Damn it, Nick. You and that itchy trigger fi trigger finger of yours. Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? Why didn't you wait for a signal? Why did you shoot? He pointed a gun at me. Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. Alright, we better get the hell out of here before more of the dead show up. Dang it, Nick. I know you're on edge and all. We're all on edge. But you didn't have to shoot that guy. Who the fuck was that back there? I don't know. Looked like he had a gun on him. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man, he drew first. That's not what it looked like to me. Shut up, Nick. What did you see, Clem? Was that guy gonna shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. He wasn't gonna do anything. I know what I saw. Either way, you could have hit one of us. Yeah, but I didn't. Look, I, I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I... No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Luke, can I talk to you alone? <sighs> Man, what a mess. Great. Don't you hey, get Clem, all... You got anything to eat? Beck's dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. Sure. Alrighty. Thanks, Clem. No problem, Alvin. I got you, homie. Well, it looks like we're going to be searching the house for food in the next episode. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Till then, deuces, ooses.